Hey there, curious minds. Are you ready to dive into the life of a true modern-day Renaissance man, Alan Richson? This might blow your mind, but the guy's not just a pretty face. He's got talents that zigzag across the entertainment industry. Buckle up, because we're about to serve you some seriously cool facts that'll give you a whole new perspective on Richson. Flashback to the mid-2000s and who pops up on Smallville? None other than Alan playing the king of the sea himself, Aquaman. Yeah, you heard that right. Before Jason Momoa's beard even considered touching the ocean currents, Richson was the main man talking to fish on the CW. But Alan's story begins tucked away in the chilly vibes of North Dakota, a move to Illinois, and finally planting roots in the sunny atmosphere of Florida was like his prelude to fame. And talk about a brainy hunk. The man snagged a double major in fine arts from Northwest Florida State College. Talk about splashing into the deep end of the talent pool. Now keep your jaws from dropping, but this fellow was actually strutting his vocal cords on American Idol in 04. Yeah, no golden ticket for him, but who needs Simon Cowell's approval when Smallville's calling your name, right? While flying high with Smallville, he voiced Aquaman in Justice League, The New Frontier, and popped up in shows like CSI Miami. But it was Blue Mountain State that had him smashing it as the champ, Thad Castle. In fact, he crushed it so hard, they even brought him back for the movie in 2016. Big screen? Oh, he's been there, flexing his villainous muscles as Gloss in The Hunger Games, Catching Fire, and as the brawny Raphael in the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles flicks. And guess what? He's not just flexing muscles, he's flexing his directing chops, too, with the flick Dark Web, Cicada 3301. Ever seen I Can Do That on NBC? Yep, that's Alan showing the world he really can do just about anything. And let's not forget his descent into the tech dystopia of Black Mirror or revving up the action in Blood Drive. But hold on, we've got a plot twist. Swapping bird feathers for tough leather, Richson swooped from playing Hawk Rapina in Titans, also seen on Supergirl in Legends of Tomorrow, to portraying the bulked-up Jack Reacher for Amazon Prime Video. The guy's breadth of roles could give any shapeshifter a run for their money. So imagine this. Alan Richson, the guy we know and love from various roles, almost wasn't Ames in the latest Fast and Furious movie. Yes, you heard it right. The role that now belongs to Richson was initially reserved for none other than the legendary Keanu Reeves. In a recent interview with Entertainment Weekly, Richson revealed how he landed the role. Apparently, while he was freezing in Winnipeg, working on another project with Hilary Swank, what a star-studded moment, he got a call. And guess what? It was about Keanu Reeves dropping out of the role that Richson ended up getting. Richson shared, and I quote, it was just a matter of luck and perfect timing. I was working on a film with Hilary Swank in freezing Winnipeg when I got a call saying things had changed with Keanu Reeves, who I think originally intended to play my part. Can you imagine Keanu Reeves speeding alongside Vin Diesel and the gang? That would have been epic. But hey, we're not complaining because Alan Richson is a very talented guy and we can't wait to see him tear it up in Fast and Furious again. Alan Richson, known for melting hearts with his breathtaking looks, showed that he's more than just a handsome face. He spared no effort to transform into the fearless Jack Reacher, including gaining 30 kilograms of pure power. But let's make one thing clear. Everyone talks about 30 kilograms of muscle, but it was 30 kilograms in total. I can't say how many of them were lean muscles because, my friend, I was eating like an animal. I didn't take shortcuts. It was all the result of hard work. I really gave it my all and my body felt the consequences of that. Alan devoted himself body and soul to intense training, even reaching the point of needing surgery to fully recover. He truly pushed the limits of his body in pursuit of perfection to portray Jack Reacher. But it's not just size that matters, folks. Richson reveals that the true heart of Jack Reacher is his sarcastic sense of humor, which not only keeps the audience entertained, but also brings depth to the character. It's the perfect combination of muscles and intelligence. With a career that paints him as part performer, part superhero, and all heartthrob, 
Alan Richson has clearly carved a name for himself in a league of legends. So the next time you see him lighting up your screen, just remember, you're looking at a man of many layers, each more surprising than the last. For today, that's it. If you were intrigued, hit that like button and subscribe for more glimpses that will blow your mind about the lives of the stars. Until next time, keep feeding that curiosity and we'll keep bringing the wonder.